welcome to my channel welcome to sandy fields world um if you're not yet subscribed if you're watching and you're not yet subscribed please get onto the channel subscribe so that you can get notifications anytime i put out a post well today <laughs> we have a different video i've been doing a lot of vlogs uh, so i assume that we need to do something different and since we're still under lockdown we're in the second week of the uh, lockdown i've even lost count now i think it's the third or eighth and 14 days that's all i remember and we're entering the, well actually we're in the second week so we should be done by monday next week today is i think 12 i'm not sure but it's tuesday so today i'm doing a styling video the first of its kind on my channel and um i hope you like what i'm doing what i've done it has taken so much time and energy so that's why i'm dressed like this if you like this you can get it at vintage bell accessories yes i'm feeling all nationalistic and stuff but anyway bambi this is not a chitambala this is a neck piece yeah anyway i'm going to do a styling video i'm basically as you've seen the title how to style a basic black dress like from looking as basic as you can to different styles to from casual to office to anything you would like so as you're going to watch in my video i'm going to do various different looks i played around with the, with my clothes and um i put this together to just you know give us some tips and guidelines and everything and i try to label each and every outfit so whatever outfit you like please comment let me know which outfit you love the most which one killed it you know i'd like to i'd like to get that information so i hope you do enjoy this video if you like the video please like give me a thumbs up the thumbs up really helps um just click on the thumbs up it doesn't even take a second click on the thumbs up you can like you can also comment leave a comment it's always nice to get that feedback i've been receiving several comments ever since i became consistent and if you like the consistency you can also tell me you can give me that feedback so um i'd really appreciate that the feedback because it helps me grow it helps me improve on the content and helps me know what my viewers really like on my channel though i can also see that through the analytics and and the statistics that i get from youtube so let's get into the styling um what else have i left out uh, most of the pieces well i do have i've not told you this i've not said this on my channel but i do have a store and most of these pieces are at my store vintage bell uganda i'll put some of the things in the description box i'll actually put the link of my store in the description box the link to the instagram page so if you like anything I guess i'll be mentioning throughout as i do the styling i'll try i'll do my best to make it as short as possible because i don't want it too long i want it as short and exciting yeah so if you like this, this these kinds of videos please let me know i trust me i can play around with my clothes and just come up with something okay all right let's get into the styling mm -hmm. with this look i decided to use only accessories to style this the black dress well i have that bracelet it's an african bracelet that i got from nairobi it's a safety pin bracelet yellow and uh, that neck piece for molds so you can see over there i did the whole shoot in the compound and that's how the look turned out do you like it i think it's pretty yay <laughs> If you like these pieces, please uh, go to the description box. I can I have the link to my store and you can make your orders at any one time. They can always be delivered during this lockdown. Yep, that's the look. Look, I went with uh, the squared mustard danglers. Uh, these are also available at my store. And the belt. Well, the belt was a little 
it's small for my waist size it goes for it's best for a size 8 so this is the look that's how it came out but uh, it's a pretty look belt did well to you know cinch the waistline it's a bit thick um, it gives you a bit of shape and the earrings just match the little yellow in the belt so what do you think about this look let me know in the description i mean in the comment section okay i was feeling myself moving forward another safety pin bracelet this time in color orange and that maasai neck piece i also got it from nairobi i have them stocked at my shop and uh i, I just matched the two that way do you like the look let me know so still using the bracelet again now i've matched it with the the maasai piece you can decide to wear both i think it look cute with both just kind of be you know different and stylish what do you think i think i like this look with the with both the bracelets yep still with the maasai look we're all we're going all orange yep let me know which look you like yeah i like everything that's why i decided to do it for you guys <laughs> i'm just showing you bringing it closer for a close and look what do you think So moving on from the Maasai pieces, I have these comb earrings, wooden comb earrings. So I decided to put a top over the dress. This is a top I got from Lad O, a friend of mine. I'll put her, her, her contacts in the description box. Uh, what do you think about this look? Mm -hmm. Well, if you have that body, you want to wear that body con dress. However, your tummy just won't let you prosper so it helps to cover up um as you can see i try to demonstrate that because it is it has that peplum kind of uh thing that's why i'm showing that so what do you think yeah so a top i got from land o and uh, for this look i decided to put that top over the dress to yeah add a, a little bit of color to the black dress and uh, let me know if you like this look and i'm inserted a little picture that i took in the compound with heels and everything do you like it so i decided to go creative here in case you don't have a black top to go with your skirt you can go creative like i did here i just wore my patchwork skirt over my dress and i pulled it a little bit up and it looks like a top what do you think i love it i just got my bomber jacket as you can see very cool navy blue this look is very perfect for a chilly day chilly evening going to the movies a chill night out or a drink with the friends um zip it up yeah i'm feeling myself mm -hmm, i feel cool <laughs> So that's the look I'm going for. What do you think? Do you like it? I love my jacket. <laughs> yeah, so I just thought of adding these shoes, the floral sneakers. Go with the shoes, they match the jacket really well. And the, the whole look is just coming together really well. I've also added those earrings, they're available. A vintage Bell Uganda karate moves i feel like i do anything look i pulled up the sleeves of the dress because the top has long transparent sleeves and this is a crop top that i put over the black dress as you can see there it looks like a dress doesn't it let me know what you think where are your comments the earrings from vintage bell very nice you for more look that's a blazer I got it a while back. I've had this blazer for very, very many years, over five years now, but it still fits well with the gold buttons on both sides. Um, what do you think? You can wear this over your black dress. 
if you really don't want to be too formal for friday or any other day it's pretty decent since the dress has a uh, a decent length yeah so i decided to sit down and feel officey yeah do you guys like the look i feel i love that blazer it's really cool yeah formal look here i added earrings to this simple nice earrings and that throw on uh it's a bit of a formal throw on i could say what do you think do you like that look i thought it's cool maybe for a cold morning because the dress has long sleeves and uh, you just throw that over to just add that form of feel what do you think you can add uh, black heels like i've inserted here yeah let me know I'm going in with the denim for this look. This is a sleeveless denim jacket. It's a washed out one. Uh, I also got this several years ago. <laughs> so I've had it for a while. It has those silver studs on the collar. And um, yeah, it's cool for a, ro a rocker kind of chic look. I decided to add that button. I mean the badge from my store. It has the word wow. Yeah, you can add that for a little funk and the studs over there with the earrings from vintage bell accessories so yeah you can wear this with heels for a night out for a chill day with the friends what do you think hold up the sleeves of the dress since it's a long sleeve i decided to put this crop top over the dress so that it looks like a top and a skirt but yeah this this look is nice if you have if you have your crop tops but you're not very comfortable wearing them uh to show off that midsection so i think this is really cool it gives off that impression that it's a top and a skirt but and you get to wear your crop top what do you think about the denim again i'm pulling up the sleeves of the dress to reach the quarter arm length and tying it all up in there as you can see the look in the inserted picture to do this look it was kind of an afterthought but the people who are not very comfortable showing off their calves um you can use a throw on this is the top i have it's a bit of a size but uh, you can throw that over your black dress to cover your calves or whatever or the midsection so what do you think this is our last look yep So we've come to the end of the video thank you so much for sticking around and watching and um i appreciate the the the, the support oh, and i forgot to tell you guys we hit 100 subscribers i know it is something small but you guys it's a big deal because hey telling people to like you to to subscribe mine is not easy and anyway it's just a big deal. I got the message from YouTube. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. So thank you so much. If you like my content, please continue to like. Um, share it with your friends, your sisters, your brothers, your loved ones. And ask them to subscribe. The other channel is dope. And honestly, after lockdown, we're going to bring way more content. Um, and... Yeah, different kinds of things that I plan to do. You guys, I'm pumped, yeah? I'm pumped. Because when you see progress, there's, there's something the progress does. It's a motivator. So when I see that I'm growing, it, it really makes me more creative and think, okay, now what am I going to do? So anyway, go before another day. <laughs> and guys, thank you so much for watching. See you on the next video. Please let me know what you like, okay? See you next time on Sandy Dewitt's channel.